I'm, I'm speechless at the moment. Um, from the first event, it was a really good decathlon, and the field was was very good. So you you cannot um, you you had no chance to uh, to do a bad discipline because the others were so good and. Um, that 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 was the point that I can score like these 8,400 points and 8,435 points. It's like uh, you broke a 35-year-old world record. It's uh, that that is amazing. I I um, four, four years ago. I, I looked at that world record and I and I said to my parents, I think that record would never be broken. And and now four years later, I'm here and uh, broke that world record. And <laughs> it's it's an amazing feeling at the moment. Because it's like all the good things came together. Because you you had a huge PB today. Yes, uh, it, uh, it it went very well. And uh, the the first the first day was better than than I expected and uh, then I, I hoped for for a good second day and um, I <laughs> sorry uh, um, and uh, then it, it, it went very well from from the hurdles uh, it was uh, the technique was bad but but the time was was still good and in the next and the next disciplines went went well too and in in the end uh, I didn't expect it, uh, that huge PB. Because it's still like the pole vault, uh, it's number eight, discipline number eight in your decathlon. It's still like a, a tough event, I think, because you know you have a high score, but then there's pole vault. Yeah, pole vault, pole vault is very tough because uh, today we had pole vault uh, at tw uh, 1, a uh, 1 p.m. and it was so hot and all the decathletes uh, are, uh, were really tired and so it's, it's a really tough event but uh, in the end I'm, I'm happy with uh, the 470 in the polo because I was so tired and um, up after that uh, the javelin went well but I had a little bit a little uh, elbow injury and because of that I cannot uh, throw the the second and the third attempt but the uh, first event was still good and the 1500 I g gave it all and it, it, it paid off. As were you aware, uh, at what moment were you aware that you uh, were able to break the world record today? After the pole vault, because b before the pole vault I, I didn't calculate because it's, it's such a tough event and everything can happen there and you can calculate after the uh, after the uh, pole vault, but but not before that because it's such a tough uh, tough event. And, and now, uh, because is your dad also your coach? Yes, my parents are my coaches, and uh, that's that's very special for me too. Because both of your parents are your coach. What what is their background in uh, athletics? Uh, they ran 400 meter hurdles uh, and 800 meters. And I, I don't know why uh, they coach the athletes at, uh, at the moment because Manuel, uh, the other German guy, is my training partner. And uh, <laughs> I don't know why why they coach the athletes at the moment, but but it works really good at the moment. Uh, so. <laughs> and uh, does your mom coach you in a different way than your dad does? Yes, uh, my my dad does uh, the hurdles and the technical events, and my mom uh, the the. Athletics and and the runs for 1500 and 400 meters. So it's it's different. What's the, what was the most emotional part of these two days? When I when I crossed the finish line after the 1500, and I knew uh, it was faster than I had to run for these 8,400 points. You have won the World Junior title, World Youth title, European Junior title, you have the World Junior record. What will be next now as a goal? <laughs> but I, don't, I, I don't know at the moment. Uh, now I need, I need a little bit rest, two weeks I think, and then I, I set my goals for the next years.